Hello Minecraft fans, Dave Chaos here, and we're going to be checking out another mod today, and um, this is called More Swords Mod, and as you guessed, it's More Swords. So this is available for single player and multiplayer for all your server admins out there. Um, right, let's get into it. So, first sword is the Blaze Sword, and um, here it is, so let's grab that, and this is the recipe, so you need a blaze rod, two iron ingots and two gold ingots. And this sword does three hearts of damage and it's got 300 uses. So let's um, have a look. There we go, that's what it looks like. Lovely. Nice little sword. Whoops. And then let's move on to the next one, which is called the blood sword. Very nice. So there it is. Even got a red name, which is pretty cool. Uh, so you've got two obsidian, two redstone and a stick. Uh, this does seven hearts of damage and it got 2,000 uses. That's not too shabby that. There it is. Looks alright. Looks a little bit larger than a, a standard sword. Okay, next we've got the bone sword. As you may have guessed, it's made out of bones. So you just need five bones to make a bone sword. Uh, one and a half hearts of damage and only 200 uses. Which is fine because you know you get loads and loads of bones that easily. So there we are. I quite like the idea of this because you know it it gives all those usual items that you pick up all the time an extra use. And there's nothing worse than being on an adventure and your sword breaks and you've got nothing to make a new one. So if you had like five bones, at least at the very least you've got a bone sword. Right. So there we go. Uh, dragon sword. Let's get that in there. Um, this has actually been changed. So. Uh, he's yet to update, the mod maker has yet to update his forum post on the Minecraft forums. So originally this was called the Dragon Sword, but he changed it to Dra the, that, basically, Dra Draconic Blade. Um, so this this is takes quite a lot to make one of these. So you need four iron blocks, a redstone, a diamond and a stick, which is quite a lot. But you do get nine hearts of damage, which is you know, a lot of fucking damage and 5,000 uses, so it is worth the materials it takes to build it. So there's that sword. Very nice. Okay, let's put that back in there. Um, the Ender Eye Sword. So, as you may have guessed, two Ender Eyes, four diamonds and a stick. Uh, eight hearts of damage and 5,000 uses, so it's almost on par with with the Dragon Sword. Uh, it's just one heart less. And let's have a look. This one's got some sticky out bits at the sides. It's quite interesting, that one. I like the look of that one. Yeah. Uh, oh, that had a colour name as well. Right, so as you can see, you know, the guy's still working on it. He's upgrading it as he goes along. Uh, the glass sword, very, very easy to make. Two glass blocks and a stick. Uh, three hearts of damage and only 20 uses. So, it's very easy to make, so you'd expect it to have very little uses. Same with the uh, the bone sword. Uh, let's see now, the Infinity Sword, not quite what you'd expect it to be. Uh, um, just two blocks of iron and a stick. I didn't show off the glass sword, did I? I'll just do show out in a minute. So there's the Infinity Sword. Yeah, not that impressive. Let me just quickly show you the, the glass sword. There we go, so... As you'd expect, you just get an outline. <laughs> Makes sense to me. Okay. Uh, the Lapis Lazuli Sword, or however you pronounce Lazuli, Lazuli, I don't know, who cares. Um, so two blocks of Lapis and a stick. This does four hearts of damage and it's got 750 uses. And it's a very interesting looking sword, that. it's got like a round handle, it's quite quite different. Not bad, not bad. Alright, we're on to, oh, the Lava Sword. So this is two buckets of lava and a stick. Um, Unfortunately, it doesn't actually set fire to anything yet. I'm hoping the mod maker will add stuff like that because it'd be good if it does like it's three hearts of damage and then extra damage over time. So, like I say, you know, it's fairly new mod. So hopefully, ideas like that will be added to it. 500 uses on that one. Oops, didn't show you did I? In a F5 mode. Ooh, is it gone? Can I open the chest while in this view? No. Oh, it's there, dumbass. Duh. There we go. So there's that one. So that'd be cool. Uh, hopefully, when the mod maker, you know, does a bit more coding, 
that'll set fire to things. Then we've got the obvious next sword, the water sword, which is changed to the Aquarius sword. Um, that does three hearts of damage, 500 uses, exactly the same as the lava sword. Uh, and there we go, it's just basically got a blue skin. Let's just chuck that in there. And then, last but not least, is the master sword. And again, you'd expect this to be like the sword that beats all swords, but it's not quite. It's got a lot of uses though. Um, and the recipe is a bit confusing because it's so little for such a good sword. So I think this will most likely change to two iron ingots, two gold diamonds, and a stick. Uh, for something that's got 10,000 uses and seven hearts of damage, that's quite low in my opinion for a recipe. Um, considering he's got like four blocks of iron for, for the other ones that do less damage and less uses. So there we are. There's the master sword. Looks quite nice. And... Uh, and that is that. Like I say, it is um, compatible with multiplayer as well as single player. So that's awesome. It's always good when something works on multiplayer as well as single player. And uh, the tutorial on how to install this mod, well, the instructions on how to install, install it, I should say, are on the forum page, which I will link in the description as always. It's very, very, very easy to install. So please don't spam the comments saying how to install this. Just go and read the forum page. It's very easy. All right, guys, if you like this mod, like this video, uh, please thumbs it up, rate it, whatever you like to do. And uh, that's it from me. Bye.